it going, Hawks? I'm Cassidy, and today I'd like to personally welcome you to today's show where we will introduce to you our brand new segment. So stick with us through the show as we move along. Before we start, as always, please stand for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thanks, Hawks. As I said before, we have a great new segment for you, but before we get to it, let's blow through these announcements. Uh, they, all, some of them may sound a bit familiar. We know you guys didn't get to see the news for a couple of days this week, so we have a pretty good amount of news, information, and reminders to bring to you, leading off with Music Group. The Hotch Musical Theater Group is meeting today in Mrs. Carson's room, as usual, so get yourself down there if that's your jam. The University of Alaska Anchorage is in town, but we still have not heard anything on their availability to swing by Hutch or not. Hopefully, something will change soon. Hey, athletes. I know Hutch has a lot of multi-athletes in the building. If any of you guys are interested in playing soccer, though, or are just looking for a fun weekend, this Saturday is an open soccer gym from 4 to 7 p.m., and it's for boys and girls. We have reached that time in the show where we are welcoming the new segment into our weekly schedule. Wrong Answers Only is a segment where a host will ask a series of students a series of questions where they will ask for an absolute, hopefully creative, funny, wrong answer. I'm pretty stoked that I got to be a part of this and hopefully it'll stick for a while. Michael, uh, Wrong Answers Only, do a push up. Keeper Boyle, what's your favorite holiday? Sunday. The temple. Wrong answers only, what's a Visco girl? A Visco girl is somebody who really likes to disco, but to video it, that's a Visco girl. Hey Drake, wrong answers only, what's your favorite Avenger? <sighs> Donald Trump. Thanks. Hey Cameron. Mm. When your teeth fell out as a little kid, wrong answers only, who came and got them? My dad, I think. I haven't seen him in a while but he could have been my dad. Natalie, wrong answers only. What sport do you play? Uh, cheese. <laughs> I was trying to brainstorm questions and stuff for that segment, and it was pretty fun asking the crew how they, wait a second, Drake, wrong answers only. How do you get to school? Buddy, I skate. How, can, how else can I stay for Erda? All right, that's what we're looking for. There are some funny questions we have yet to ask, and I can't wait to show you guys what we've come up with. For now, though, Natalie has a baller blindfold challenge for you guys to be absolutely impressed with. What's up, Hawks? It's Natalie, and today I'm bringing you another episode of Blindfold Challenge. So today we have Mr. Shannon here. He's going to try to shoot a free throw. So go ahead, Mr. Shannon. So it's for Take Kobe and shot. Gigi. I don't know if I could ever make a shot like that. Been there, tried that, took out a truck mirror, no joke. <laughs> hey seniors, the yearbook class wants to see, show you guys off in this year's yearbook. If you guys weren't much of a head turner freshman year and had a total glow up, send those pictures into Miss Bernheim. Your book also wants to gas you guys up by showing off what you're whipping, so send in a picture of you and your car. I think the seniors know exactly who's gonna submit their photos. Also, siblings who go to Hutch and pets are welcome as well, so don't forget to submit your cute photos. And before we finish up the show, we have a couple people growing up awfully quickly to recognize. <laughs> okay, Grandpa. Let's get today's, today's ridiculous video for birthdays. Happy birthday, Hawks. I hope this week is a good one. And from all of us here at the Hawk News, thanks, thanks for, for watching. watching.